What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to Neo Automata. We're busy finishing off the quest in the underground arena where we have to take over these machines. I love 9S's new outfit. <laughs> it just looks so, so cool. Uh, we have to take over these machines and battle in the Colosseum. So now we got rank three, which is level 50. Speak to a machine you want to control. I'm only being given two options. I'm not even being given this guy as an option. I don't know why. But hopefully we can make do with this guy. If not, I guess we could always come back later. I don't know if you have to do this as 9S. Who knows? There are just certain quests that uh, you kind of have to experiment with to see. So let's give you a try. You only have fists, so... This is going to be tough. Okay. Woo! Come on! Why has he got to dodge backwards? It's really frustrating. Alright, let's... Oh, he's just going to do exactly the same attack as me. Take that! <laughs> Okay, who's dropping down now? We got a bunch of guys showing up. Ah! Ah! This is not gonna go well. Whoopsie daisy, these guys are just shooting everywhere. Good thing I've got a lot of health. I wish I could run though, how do I run? Because these other guys seem to run some of the time. Whoops! I jumped right into him. Bad idea. <laughs> no! Okay, we might actually lose this one. This is going to be interesting. Alright, take this! Let's hit this guy while we're here. And now we got just one guy on the far side. I've tried to be as tactical about this as possible, but it's not easy. It's much harder than it looks. Wow. And of course there's more. You have got to be kidding me. How am I supposed to fight these guys? This is going to be... Whoa! This is hard! No! You gotta be kidding me! This is impossible! <laughs> this is impossible! I clearly need a more powerful machine. So I'm gonna have to sneak up behind some of these machines and take them over. Alright, we can do that. Let's see. We wanna take over... Who do you wanna take over? I think we want to take over him. Let's let's see. If he explodes, then he explodes. But maybe we've hacked him now? Oh, he's just going to explode. So I don't actually know how to sneak up on them then. Do you have to... I don't know, just arrive? Without... The, like, you have to hack him from afar? Hmm. Okay, I don't, I don't know if this quest is totally worth it. It was a fun gaming experience, but I guess it might be just one of those ones that I might leave until the post game just because it seems like a lot of effort just to fight in a coliseum or probably very little story reward right just like the trial of sand i'm not sure how much that really does for us but who knows maybe i will oh we got to take out these guys again yo i tried to Okay, that did not work how I wanted it to. I gotta switch back into into Android mode because I'm <laughs> I'm thinking in terms of like um, <laughs> I'm thinking in terms of um, mach machine mode because I was getting so used to that combat. Why do the mice always stand in the background? It's very 
unfortunate for them and there's not much I can do about it. If they want to stand there and get hit, that's... At this point, I'm just like, that's on them. Okay, let's run and fetch the medicine for the moose. TB literally looks like a knight now. It looks really cool. Why do the boars always just charge at me? All right, let's, uh, while we're here, let's just quick save because it has been a while. <laughs> it's been a minute. So I'm pretty sure we're going to find either the medicine in the supermarket or we're going to have to make it ourselves. I think he mentioned making it himself, but I don't know if he knows the recipe. Can you just make medicine? I feel like it has to be synthesized in a lab. But hey, maybe 9S knows way more than I know about this. He probably does. <laughs> All right. Whoa, the ingredients are somewhere in here. Okay, this is going to take a while. Oh, writing implement. Analysis. It is a writing implement. Human used it to record information. Many humans also believed pens were mightier than swords. That's insane. <laughs> It was a common human idiom, meaning unclear. In other words, forge, peace, wage, love, not war. I can't remember how the phrase goes. So we're going to probably find all the ingredients lying around here somewhere. Uh, did I run right past it? I think I did. Oh, there it is. Hello. Cosmetics. Never seen this before. Analysis. That is a waxy solid known as lipstick. Humans applied it to their lips in order to appear more attractive. How odd. Proposal. Applying it to your own lips might lead to a further understanding of human customs. No thanks. <laughs> um, y y don't knock it till you tried it, to be. Who knows? You might look really good. Toothbrush. What's this? Analysis. That is a hygienic tool known as a toothbrush. Humans moved it back and forth across their teeth at a rapid rate to reduce the probability of cavities. Cavities is in caves? Cavities? <laughs> cavities are bits of decayed enamel caused by acids in the mouth. The cave analogy is not altogether inaccurate. That's probably true. Hmm, well, it's got nothing to do with us. Do you know? Have you ever brushed teeth? Maybe you don't actually know that you need it. If all androids have bad breath, is your breath bad? <laughs> Will the androids know? Crystal and medical journal. There we go. Alert. Organic pharmacology textbook discovered. The data contained within should prove effective for ungulates such as moose. Page 278 contains a recipe for an anti-inflammation analgesic, which has a high probability of... Whoa, 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 hold on. Analgesic, those are painkillers, right? We haven't even cracked this thing open yet. How do you know what's in it? The contents of this book are contained in my internal database. Why did we have to get the book? What? Why didn't you tell us that when we first started looking for it? A request for information was not submitted. I do not voluntarily uh volunteer information <laughs> well this has been a glorious waste of time well, let's just make the medicine to get it back to that machine okay do we just have the medicine now or do we have to take it back we probably have to take it back um although i do see another collectible here uh maybe it's upstairs i am curious if like there because we found a whole bunch of items so perhaps this will give us something useful here is something else. Analysis. That's a form of sustenance known as extreme weight loss superfood. Humans consumed it in place of more traditional edibles in order to reduce body mass. Mm, why would they want to do that? Humans often took in more energy than they expended. Accumulated calories were converted to fat and stored, decreasing physical capabilities. Man, humans had it rough. <laughs> you know what's even more rough is that scientists are realizing they don't actually understand how obesity works. So probably... Half, if not more, of that was completely inaccurate. <laughs> and legit, though, there, there's all kinds of things they're learning now. It's really about probably just calorie count rather than anything else. Um, they used to, like, blame it on the types of foods you eat and all kinds of nonsense like that, but probably not the case. Um, certainly related much more to how much you eat. Also, you know... Your body can kind of make use of all kinds of different nutrients going into it. So 
if you just, you know, if you cut down on carbs, it's not going to do much for you. You're just going to start burning fats or burning proteins, whatever. And that doesn't necessarily mean weight loss. You know, it just means a completely different state of energy synthesis in your body. So <laughs> random stuff. But point is a lot of like the stuff you'll find on weight loss not not accurate you just gotta restrict how much you intake in and you know exercise kind of helps but the reality is you know you're probably just gonna eat all of that stuff again after you exercise because now you burnt a bunch of energy so really the trick does come down to restriction but of course i'm not a dietitian so please do not take my advice listen to your doctor they'll tell you what's most effective don't don't listen to someone like me i just learned this stuff randomly um over the years it's just random stuff don't listen to me all right let's let's see how the moose likes his ibuprofen because apparently that's what we're, we're mixing up here i didn't know you could just do that but sure medicine thank you i will administer it immediately all right let's hope our moose can get up again because i'm i miss seeing him the medicine seems to have worked. She's sleeping soundly. Um, I hope she's sleeping. Good to hear. Animals are strange creatures. Unlike us, they cannot be easily repaired. Uh, yes, that goes for most living creatures. It must be difficult to possess such inconvenient bodies. However, unlike us, they are also warm. Uh, so I've heard. <laughs> Before I forget, please take this as payment for the medicine. Beast high quality sachet. Quality sachet. Once again, we'll be waiting. Quality sachet. Okay, let's look this up. It's... Unrelated to the animal bait. I thought it might be related to that, but clearly not. Quality sachet. Quality sachet. Oh, we, st we have all these other things here that I haven't even looked at. But you can't even use them. Sachet, a pouch that emits a scent animals love, prevents them from running when approached. A pouch that emits a scent animals love lets you ride them anytime you want. Okay, so you don't even need animal bait. Well, that's good. Now we don't, I mean, I don't have to worry about like being conservative about it. We can just grab an animal and go. Can I take one of you guys? <laughs> Would save me a lot of time. All right, let's, now that we're actually able to move on to the quest, let's have a plan. So I want to just clear out this area. And then we'll head along down here. I know that we have to cross the bridge. So we'll cross the bridge when we get to it. And we'll clear out this area here. And then we'll move across to the Forest Kingdom. And get started on actually tracking down Princey Boy. Killing them again. Finding out what's going on with A2. Oh man, I am excited to see A2 again. Because there's got to be something going on there. And we just don't know it. So, ah, this is long overdue. It has been too long. But I do see some chests along here that we need to open. <laughs> Woo! These guys jumped from really far! Come on! Is that all you've got? Surely not. Surely you got more than that. <laughs> yeah, I thought so. That was way too easy. Alright, I see a chest in the valley, which makes me curious how you're supposed to get that. So, first things first, there's a chest somewhere here that we can't get to. Oh, it's back here. There we go. Oh, you know what? It might just be across the valley. That's fine. But let's go take out these guys. Oh, wow. I don't think we, we fought this group. Oh, no, we did fight them previously, but they've just respawned. Okay, this should be relatively doable. You know what I'm wondering? Oh, it's too late to sneak up on them. Ah, I was hoping we could hack them and get him for that... That, uh... Up. On a CM quest! I almost said Citadel, but there's no Citadel in this game. Right, let's let's use the hammer, because it's a bit overdue. <laughs> there's just too many of these guys. Oh, 
I don't want to hit the, the pig. Come on. Poor guy. He's just chilling there. Come on. Step into the radius. Come this way. Chibi! No! You made me waste my power. All right. No biggie, though. Okay. Now, let's go grab... Oh, there are still some pickups here. Oh, you know what? The chest is over here somewhere. Or it's on top there. But let's grab these. Make sure we don't miss anything. Because who knows? You might just find a quest item along the way. And you don't want to miss those. Because they're not marked on the map. And having to backtrack to find them later is not, not convenient. Oh, I think we're going to have to go over the top there. Huh. Or climb up. Can we climb up? No, I don't see a way to do that. Oh, dead android body. Not voting well. Oh, I see. We can go up here. Okay, great. Yeah. There's the chest. And there's another one down here. So, uh, oh, we can come back to that afterwards. Let's... Climb up here. Oh no, we can't climb up here. Hmm. How doth we get upstairs then? <laughs> this music is so motivating. <laughs> it's bizarre that it has that effect, but I guess it's just because it's got this constant energy to it. Sometimes the city music uh, is way too slow for me. Oh, I thought we had to hack that one. I guess we don't. Meteorite. Now, can we climb up from here? There has to be a way upstairs. This is all these bridges and things. Okay, we're we're gonna figure this one out for sure. You know what? Can we ride? It'll save me a lot of time. Yeah. Whoa! Look at that speed. That's awesome. Okay, we might just have to go across from here. Oh, you can just pick things up as you jump past them. How do I get off you? Oh, that's out. <laughs> okay, so we gotta... Oh, do we have to jump across from there? Is this gonna be like... Oh, wow. Are we gonna have to run all the way around? No, there's gonna be an easier way to do this. Point is, we have to get up there somehow. Oh, we could perhaps go from up here. No. Oh, uh, we're really going to have to island hop, aren't we? That's probably exactly what we have to do. Oh, darn. Okay. Let's start with this island here. Perhaps... <laughs> perhaps we can get across from here. Okay, let's have a look. Hmm. There is potentially somewhere to land on the far side there. Uh... Oh! Oh, we go from across there. You're just gonna slowly walk towards us? Sure. I'll take that! King of the forest. <laughs> King of the forest, my my ass. He's not he's like not even functional. He's just a little baby. Yeah. <laughs> What good did your training do you? <laughs> Nothing. Okay, so I'm a bit confused exactly what is the best way to get across. There will be a way. We just have to figure it out. So let's start on this side. We can't climb up there because I'm using the map to sort of figure out where we can stand and where we can't. Clearly, we need to get on top of that island there, which probably means going from up there. Hmm. I think we're going to have to employ our long jump abilities, which is very doable. Okay, we're going to have to island hop this. This is... This is doable. We can do this. Okay, I've been, <laughs> I've been practicing. I I've been building my skills. We're ready for this. Okay, we just have to get across to there. 
That's perhaps the hard bit. No. It doesn't want us to stand there. Okay. Do we have to go from higher up, perhaps? It seemed like an awful waste if we have to go from... Oh, that's, an, that's a good way to gain some extra height. Okay. Perhaps it's doable like that. Yeah, look at that. We can do it. Oh, no, we can't. It really does not want us to stand there. All right, let's 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 see. Perhaps we can do this. No, I wanted to do that. Yeah, that did not work. Okay. In any case... Oh, no, we definitely have to run and jump across. Okay. Maybe we need to jump from on top of the waterfalls on top of there. Okay. I got a plan. Let's execute it. <laughs> you know what's great about this game is like, there are just things they don't explain to you. And I initially complained about it a lot, but it definitely forces you to be creative and sort of just figure things out through trial and error, which is a totally new way of looking at the game and playing it. So I definitely appreciate it. Okay, let's go from here. We want to get on top of that island in the middle if we can. Oh, wow. This is this is a long jump, but let's go for it. No, I want to I want to run and do this. No. Okay, let's try from the other side. I'm gonna try climbing up from here. I doubt it's gonna be possible. Aw, oh, man, there has to be a way up here. There has to be. It's too complicated otherwise. You know, it's gonna be something as silly as just probably... <laughs> probably as, as just going from on top of this thing. Or on top of these pillows, perhaps? Those are gonna be hard to land on, though. Oh, we can figure this out. Come on, 9, 9S and 2B. We got this. Look at it. Okay, somehow we managed that. Don't ask me how. <laughs> Shockwave. I got plenty of those. Oh. What is this? <gasps> oh, great. We got a powerful B in here. They, they don't want us coming anywhere near this. I guess you were supposed to come from the other side then. I can't, I must have just shortcutted it by mistake. Whoops. <laughs> you know what? Being creative pays off. If you can do it because you're creative, is it cheating? I don't think so. All right, let's grab whatever is in this chest. It's probably a weapon, right? Oh, wow. This looks cool, whatever this is. Oh, this is gonna be like samurai fists. Virtuous grief. Well, that was certainly a lot of grief to get. <laughs> I hope it was worth it. Uh, weapons. Uh, it's not gonna be there. Oh, let's have a look. Virtuous grief. 120 to 150. Um. Not as much as some other weapons. But it looks super cool. Oh, I am tempted, but you know what? I like my sword. Let's we'll stick with the sword. Now, there was actually a chest this side that I, I was doing all of this for in the first place. <laughs> so let's go grab that. There's also a pickup here somewhere. There it is. 100G. Maybe the G was not worth it, but at least I'm collecting all the weapons. <laughs> My, my inner completionist is happy. <laughs> okay, there is a chest here. Uh, oh, don't tell me it's below us. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I was like, wow, that would have been such a waste of effort. A large recovery for that? You're kidding me. Really? A large recovery just for that? 
not worth it. All right, let's have a look at the map, make sure we haven't missed any areas of the ground. Whoops. Uh, no, we've actually cleared a lot of it out. Okay. So I guess we're supposed to come from here, really. <laughs> I'm too curious to my own good. I end up wasting so much time on things that probably don't need time wasting. Now let's be careful not to drop off the edge. There is a collectible. There it is. Why is the map off by like a meter or two? It's really distracting. Okay, the way forward is down there. We're first gonna go around and collect all the chests we didn't collect last time. Let's do that. And then it's off to see the forest prints. I'm excited for that. Okay, another chest here. Small recovery obtained. Wait, there is another chest. How many are there? Oh, is it on top? Or is it underneath? I reckon it's on top. That's fine. We'll just head a little bit around. No biggie. Uh, let's probably just take these guys out while we're here. Okay, let's see if we can hack one of them from here. Ooh, not gonna be easy. Ooh, not gonna be easy. I'm trying to sneak up on him. No! Dang it! <laughs> I was trying I was trying to be as efficient as possible. <laughs> Don't hurt the moose. Maybe this is why they need medicine because I'm hurting all of them all the time. Oh, how are you doing, mate? I guess I'm hacking you. I was gonna try and take over it, but they just saw me somehow. It's kind of funny if if we're hurting all the, the moose mooses and that's why they end up needing medicine, it's kind of like malpractice essentially. <laughs> <laughs> but with androids, which is pretty funny. All right, let's make sure we just collect everything on our first time through. There could always be anything useful, you never know. There you are. I knew you were there. Okay, let's go get this chest that we clearly ran past. Eh, just keep throwing these things away, Ninus. It's not like I'm I'm working here. Uh, wherefore art thou? Are you hiding the site? Wherefore meaning why? I always ask the wrong question. <laughs> Every time I remember that quote, I always take a little while to remember that wherefore is why, not where. <laughs> Strange doll. Okay, let's have a look at this. A strange doll that was nailed to a tree, ragged and worn. It's unclear what this item was used for. Uh, probably to keep a kid company, especially with the way we're just killing <laughs> mooses left, right, and center. All right, let's. We could carry on down these stairs, or we could explore over this side. Who knows what you might find? You could find anything. Wait, the way forwards is down there, I think, so let's not be too hasty. Ha, huh, I had a feeling there was something in here. Mushroom! Well, who knows, maybe you need a mushroom to upgrade a weapon or something. This game's logic is not always obvious. I swear there was something on top of here. Maybe I'm just imagining it. There's definitely a chest over the side. Yeah, perhaps it's under. Oh, you know what? It's in here. There we go. I'm so glad we have the markers on the map. I wouldn't find these without it. It's definitely quality of life. 10,000 G that I don't need. Okay. Finally ready to start heading into the Forest Kingdom. Let's do that. Well, I say finally, but I still see one more chest. I thought I had them all. 
One more enemy, and I think two beasts was you taking him out. Why do I always have to clean up after you, two B? You never finish the job yourself. <laughs> okay, clearing up the last of these collectibles. Perhaps I'm being a little bit too OCD about collecting all of these things, but my logic is just, I want to do it once, be done with it, never have to come back. Oh, great. It's on top of there. Okay. Cool. We can do this. Uh, we can get across there somehow. Somehow. Uh, probably, be, probably need to go around to get there, but we can do that. Whoa, I didn't mean to go right at him. Okay, yeah. Why didn't I check this way first? I should have. I hope it was worth it. A thousand G, come on. I'm pretty sure we couldn't pick this one up. Yes, okay. And there was one more collectible up there. Oh, it's down here, never mind. Okay, well, that's it, I think. I think. Yeah, okay. Let's head across. Meet our destiny. It'll be really interesting if A2 has been like following us this whole time and she so only shows up now. Had a king? But how can a concept like loyalty be understood by a machine? 9S, when will you learn? You keep saying these things, but these machines clearly are intelligent. Whoa! What? 128 years ago? Ooh, we're learning some new stuff. His majesty. He's dead. Oh, that was the original king, right. The king who gave all for us. We're gonna find out how the prince came to be. So benevolent and kind. And now he's dead. Oh, such cool little bits of backstory filling things in. It makes the dialogue make so much more sense. It's this sure is sad. Uh, yes. It sure is. Maybe it's time to pick a new ruler. But we royal knights still have a mission. Your, uh, what? Protect his body? That sounds... We placed his unnecessary. Oh! Oh my goodness, and then we killed him? Wait, A2 killed him, right? We must raise this child so he might one day be our new king. Whoa! That's scary. Oh my goodness, guys. I feel so bad now. How could we do this? Oh my gosh. We sure are heartless. I mean, we didn't know, but... Jeepers. Hey, I wanted the chest. <laughs> you just took me right past it. Oh man, that was deep, way deeper than I expected. Let's uh, make sure we just grab everything. Wow, guys, I feel kind of sad now. I almost want to cry. Is that, is that fair <laughs> to cry for something we didn't even do? Oh man, you know, I... I'm just kind of shook by this, that the game already feels so rich and complex, but then you go through it a second time and all the little details that get filled in, it just blows your mind. The stuff you learn, it's... How? How does this happen? How... How can the entire context of everything change on a second playthrough? I'm... I'm shocked. What is even going to happen 
in the third playthrough. It's gonna completely blow my mind. Of that, I'm pretty confident. All right, well, we're here again. I know some big bad guy's gonna show up. <gasps> These guys are dead? No. Did I not notice this last time? That is awful. Um, let's just go through here. That is awful. Uh, anyway, moving on. Um, I want to get the chest here. This is oddly empty. I feel like it's a trap. I'm being lured by the chest and I'm going to be attacked by someone. Or maybe not. I guess not. I thought it'd be a trap, but... So who killed these animals? Is that A2's doing? It's not familiar to me. I feel like this is the first time I'm noticing that. Poor guys. And of course this door is closed because we need um, Pascal to open it for us. Hang on, there's something in the corner here. Oh gosh. This is seriously creepy, guys. Who is killing the animals? It's gotta be A2. I can't think who else it could be. Virtually anyone else would... What? No one else has a reason. A2, I don't even know if she has a reason, but... We don't understand her reasons for anything, so it's possible. I feel so bad that we go and kill these guys and then they're king. I mean, at least participate in it. That's awful. Whoa, dodge! <laughs> this gigantic samurai. Is he doing that jumping act to take on... Uh, let's focus on him with the laser. Okay, now that we got time slowed down, we can do a lot of damage, hopefully. Woo! How did he do that? Did he just, like, step on us? Usually that doesn't do much damage. Or any. These guys really are protective of their king. I don't blame them. It makes sense now. Wow, those ticks just took a little while to pop in. It makes sense that they're so protective, but at the same time, kind of sad. Oh, we're going to have to get up there, aren't we? Oh. Hmm. We'll figure that out. We'll figure it out. But w before we do... Let's head across... Hang on, there is a collectible this side. And then let's head across this little land bridge. Just in case there's anything new there. I know we've done it before, but who knows? There could be a chest that we couldn't get because so we need to hack it or something. It's just, I, I've played so many episodes of this now that I can't even remember what we found out here. Could be absolutely nothing, but only one way to find out. Yeah, we've already cleared this out. Unless there is still something around this side, but I doubt it. Nope. Okay. And I remember our problem was figuring out how to get out of here. But we can do that. <laughs> All right, let's do this. <laughs> there we go. Not not too shabby. I feel like every time 2B falls down, the game makes me stop moving. You think she's not doing that anymore. Okay, we got to figure out how to get across. So we got to get up, which... Ah, this will be interesting. Am I really going to have to step on each of those? That's going to be tough to nail that landing. I think that's exactly what it wants me to do. Oh, boy. I'm going to have to walk carefully here. Or I could hopefully nail it like that. Oh, boy. This is going to be tough. Oh, this is going to be tough. This is going to be tough. <laughs> well, let's see if we can do it, though. Okay. Oh man, I'm nervous. This is tough. This is tough. We can do it. Okay, they're at just the perfect distance. Let's not mess this up. Okay. Oh, two more to go. Two more to go. We got this. We got this. We got this. Two more to go. Ah, ah. 
right on the edge. Please don't knock me off, TB. I'll be so mad. We did it, we did it. Whew. Oh, man. Oh, man. Cypress stick. A stick. Really? My heart is literally beaten for that stick. Please don't be a waste. Please be the most powerful weapon in the entire game, please. Where are you? Where are you? <sighs> You're kidding me. What a joke. What a joke, seriously? A stick made of cypress wood can hardly be called a weapon, but somehow grants courage to its user. <laughs> this is a joke. I was in a dead sleep when mum started shouting, wakey, wakey, she squawked. Rise and shine, today's a very important day. Today's your first visit to the castle. Annoying, right? But I got up anyway. <laughs> I am very, very annoyed about that. Very annoyed. Wow. They totally let us on. They had us on. I'm annoyed. <laughs> They, and they didn't have to, but they did. They put that, that, that's why they gave us the map thing so that now we'd be lulled into a, a false sense of security. Like what shows up on the map, you gotta go get it. And it was all just a trap. Playing off of our expectations. Not okay at all. <laughs> all right, well, we are here. And <laughs> we are here. But we'll save that for next time, ladies and gentlemen, when we when we actually go into the Forest Kingdom and see what A2's been up to. I'm kind of got very mixed feelings about it. But from here, it's I can't foresee there being many more delays. We've already I know we've had a lot, but at the same time, uh, it's been totally worth it learning about the world like this. Um, what's going to happen next? I'm pretty sure A2 goes and kills the little baby king and then we end up going to the coast to save us all from that giant machine thing, the Godzilla guy. And then at that point, 9S story diverges from two Bs. So we are very close, very close to the fork in the road where we'll actually probably get so much more information about the world. I'm hoping we learn a lot of stuff on that part of the journey. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, see you guys next time on the Automata. Until then, stay safe and bye for now.